we actually use the terminal electron acceptor other than oxygen and no other organic compound. Means the terminal electron acceptor are NO3, SO4, double minus, Fe3, Mn plus, O, etc. Now, the, in this process, the enzyme systems are operating and operating in four different groups. For example, in aerobics, that toxic chemical and their growth has been taking place. So, growth supporting and at that time, their enzyme is the oxygenase. In case of no growth, means the bacteria are not able to thrive or utilize the carbon source. At that time, the fungi generally break down the com complicated carbon and these complicated carbon are being broken down by two enzymes that is oxygenase and oxygenase. In anaerobic situation, we find it the opposite situation occurring here. The reverse of oxidation that is reduction. So reduction is being taking place in presence of reductase or something different being are synthesized. So synthase or reductase are uh, being done by the androgen factory. In growth, no growth support means there will be no multiplication of the bacteria and fungi. Means at that time they require cofactor. If the vitamins are being added in the form of cofactor. Now the, the important rate limiting step is this in this process is the uh, rate of degradation. Rate of degradation is dependent on physically four factors light, water, oxygen and temperature and another thing is the microbes. You know, the already you know that microbes are again based on respiration are of two types. So respiration is important in there. In one you need to add oxygen and another you need to add NO3, Fe3, uh, Mn4, SO4 double minus etc. in the medium or in the uh, media to get the degradation. In this case, some chemicals are photo -degrading. So, light can be used. For example, in this case, what type of light? Ionizing type of light are being used. Next one, the chemicals need to be soluble in water. Third, the mixing and for aeration, oxygen is required. Temperature, it is found that the higher temperature, faster degradation takes place. Now the academically another thing is very important that is whether biodegradation has been taking place or not. So that can be measured biodegradation if takes place aerobically then there will be the chance of producing CO2. And if CO2 is being produced that then you have known that we have the apparatus in physiology that is respiroscope. In respiration, they are consuming oxygen and ultimately they are producing CO2. This CO2 is being absorbed by KOH, potassium hydroxide absorbed that chemical, means CO2. As a result, in that respirometer, there is a pipe. Within this pipe, there is a vacuum created by the absorption of CO2. So, whenever the vacuum created, the amount of water displaced within this vacuum portion. So by this respirator matter, we measure biodegradation has been taking place or not. Another thing is that in uh, coal mines, there is an instrument for measuring the methane. Through this instrument, we measure the amount of methane. Or if acids are being produced by the hydrolysis process, then there will be the chances of changing in pH so, measuring the change in pH, we are ultimately getting what amount of degradation has been taking place. Now, the applied topics is bio remediation. Is the bio remediation? 
and it is all, only used in the waste site. There are varieties of bioremediation technology. One, using the natural bacteria or natural fungi. Another one is genetically engineered bacteria. The genetically engineered bacteria is the first developed by in this whenever a petrol tank is covering the sea for the destination. If there are some oil spill, he uses two naturally natural things. One is the A. In straw, the spill will not go further away or it will not dilute within the uh, way we see. Within this uh, straw, as a bioreactor, he added some bacteria for toluene degradation, xylene degradation, degradation naphthalene degradation. That is petrol spill. Then up to that time, the bacteria will uh, grow and multiply. But wherever the oil spill become converted into carbon dioxide, then no other bacteria will be capable to hide there, and the dead bodies of the bacteria will be within the uh, basin of the sea. So, in his engineering aspect is the genetic engineering. And next one is the through mycobacteria. Though it is not generally applied on some natural products, for example, petroleum and biodegradable plastics, and biodegradation also biodegradable and biodegradable starch link. Another is the in presence of sunlight some compound become biodegradable and plastics are generally made UV degradable. Now the Zeno grade 75 to 100 percent in 3 years you see TTT takes 4 years, Chlor 10 takes 5 years. Not only that, there are some polychlorinated vitamins. It is being used by the electric industry for insulated insulation purpose. Poly aromatic hydrocarbon, these are also being used. These chemicals are long lasting. As it is long lasting, so the dumping site has been treated with some specific bacteria. These include whenever there is some aromatic rings, we need to add pseudomonas. Pseudomonas have the inborn capability to degrade the aromatic ring. Similarly, some uh, fungi has the capability. This is the phenolopic. And we know petroleum is also degraded in by the petro, pseudomonas, proteas, canicola, canicola is a fungus. There are two processes of remediation. One is in situ, means the chemical which are being leached from the basin into the soil are being treated on that site, is called in situ. And if this chemical through drain goes into the oxidation pond and there will be treated, there is called uh, ex situ biology. In, in situ, the local soil bacteria if uh, do the uh, dump in a place that place having the soil bacteria and that chemical also with the food substances we add uh, some fungi and bacteria that will convert then it will transfer into another uh, place where some uh, bacteria are being added which after 3 months with some water spray and some nutrient spray that will convert it into another one that is called composting. Now controlled solid phase if we add charcoal, charcoal then charcoal is with the joint of the bar, 